what a fighter she is and I've just admired from afar um, her battle and how courageous she's been and I have absolutely loved watching her team rally around her and support her um, for this cause and then also our conference. I mean I love the fact that our conference coaches are, are rising up and, and um, supporting one of our own. He helped me through my situation with my wife this past couple of years and, and just thoughts and prayers and you know with the other coaches and you know now she's going through it and so it's you know it's to me it's uh, returning that uh, that caring feeling I think when you care about someone and I think that's what's so special about the Sun Belt but for, for Angel you know we continue to keep on our prayers and our thoughts and I know with uh, you know the advancement of medications and different type of medicines and stuff there's a lot of hope for her. If anybody can beat this, uh, it would certainly be Angel. And uh, she's a tremendous ambassador for our conference and, and women's basketball uh, in the Sun Belt and nationwide. I think that she's definitely a fighter. Uh, you know, you want to encourage her to keep fighting. And, you know, I think she, there's no doubt she'll come out a winner and it'll make her stronger. And I'm sure it's going to make the people around her stronger. So I'm looking forward to competing against her for quite a few years. Angel, we're praying for you and all those who are affected, your student athletes and anyone who's around you. Coastal Carolina women's basketball team stands with you. She's fiery. Uh, she's got a lot of fight in her. I mean, you can tell she's a competitor. And, um, you know, those things are going to go, they go hand in hand with what she's battling right now. And uh, that competitiveness, that leadership, the fact that she does things the right way, uh, all those things, uh, you know, are, are, are going to be benefit her as she moves forward. We know you're in a, a fight right now, in a battle, but we know that uh, you are, are strong and that uh, God is with you in this, and we just pray for you, and I look forward to seeing you again here in the near future. We love her as, as one of our own. She's, she's certainly um, a special member to us and a special member of this conference, and uh, we just join her in her fight um, against cancer, and we love Angel very much. Good luck, Angel. To hear the news that she's battling cancer was, um, you know, very sad to me, but I know she's a fighter, and I know that um, she will uh, beat this. And uh, Angel, you know, I support you. You're always in my thoughts and prayers. She's very inspiring to everyone. She's a very friendly person, and she's a winner, and she's a fighter. And I'm very sorry that she received the diagnosis that she did. However, I know she's going to use this time to inspire every female and everyone around her in this fight. And I know her team's going to be stronger this year. It's going to spur her on to do even bigger things. She's been working really hard. Her kids play hard, so I know she's going to battle for them. So in this fight, we're fighting with her this season. We're cheering for her all the way. And Angel, I want to let you know, I met you and I remember the first time we met in Ljubljana. And ever since that time, you know, I've been tracking you, and I'm going to continue to rally behind you as, as a friend and as a coach in this conference. So go get him, Angel. On behalf of the Sunbelt Conference and all of its presidents and chancellors, athletics directors and administrators, coaches, and especially our student athletes, Congratulations, Angel, on receiving the prestigious Pat Summit Most Courageous Award from the United States Women's Basketball Association. During the past several months, you have inspired all of us in the Sun Belt with your courage and determination as you win this battle. And I join the App State Nation family and all your coaching colleagues in the Sun Belt and across the nation in wishing you continued good luck. My staff and I look forward to seeing you and your Mountaineer team here in New Orleans in March for the Sun Belt Tournament. It's been really great, the support not only from the Sun Belt um, Conference Office, but from the other Sun Belt coaches within the league. They've really, you know, wrapped their arms around me, you know, just texting, calling, just always making sure that, you know, I'm okay, talking to my assistants on the road. And now, um, just com completely humbled at the fact that they're gonna take a game and they're gonna use that game as an opportunity to not only celebrate, um, the journey that I've been through, but to raise awareness. Um, this is a, a female cancer, so I think it's really important that we do put it on that platform for our student athletes to be aware, but just really grateful and humbled by the support of the Sunbelt Conference.